Uh, Naomi, Carol has become a much more prominent character this season. What is it like to develop her further? It has been so fun to dig into Carol and look at you know, what What would happen when if some of her biggest triggers were out of the office <laughs> and she suddenly has uh, more work to do, like actual work to do, you know, is she is she ready for that? You, d- you definitely got the sense in the first two seasons that she was tired, she was downtrodden, she was weary. Mm. But then she gets actual responsibility. She's like, wait a minute, I don't know if I want this either. It's a change of pace for her, for sure. <laughs> Uh, Danny, Brad was headed to prison at the end of last season. Mm. How's season three shaping up for him? Well, he's out of jail. So that's, <laughs> things are looking up. <laughs> right away, things are looking up. I think Brad uh, went through some things. It'll be fun to see what he learned um, in his time reflecting. I think what we what we all know is that when Brad spends enough time reflecting, he comes out with some schemes. So um, it, it'll be a new form of danger for everyone around him. but. I don't know. Maybe he's reformed. We'll see. Maybe maybe we'll see. Here's hoping. <laughs> <laughs> Brad and Carol have an interesting relationship in this season, too. What was it like for the two of you to find this rapport together? Naomi, maybe starting with you? Well, I'll tell you. A rapport with Danny Pooty? Easy. Easy. Simple. Like a walk in the park, you know? But I will say, it's true. Danny is obviously uh, such a great actor and also so warm and welcoming as a person. It's just, it was so easy to hit the ground running. Honestly, right? Like we just started doing that. It was like, and it was like, I'm safe. I'm safe with yeah. Danny Pooty. Uh, the same, it's the same. Mirroring back all these comments. <laughs> I'm working with a dynamo here. Naomi is a writer. Uh, actor, so that always feels like a secret weapon to have <laughs> on set because I know she'll come up with things or if things don't work, she's seeing it from a level where she she understands our, mm-hmm. our characters too. So that feels nice. It feels like um, an extra set of, uh, of tools that we have uh, in playing, you know? So, but yeah, that, working with Naomi was my very first scene directing this year. And I just felt like that was a gift to me because she was able to ride my neuroses out and just stand and be there and be present and be funny and honest and genuine. And um, it was delightful. You mentioned uh, that you got to step behind the camera this season. What was it like to direct the rest of this cast? Oh, it was, I mean, I, I feel- favorite? Who's, who's your favorite? favorite? Well, I mean, obviously. <laughs> Obviously, uh, it's gonna be hard to yeah to, to beat that um, to beat that uh, scene. But I think I was very fortunate because I know everyone in this cast and everyone is amazing. And also, everyone is familiar with working with an environment where people are doing multiple things. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm. You know, writers, actors, directors. Um, Ashley also directed an episode this year. David Hornsby also directed an episode. Rob directs and writes too. So. Um, that feels safe in this environment where I could step in, fully acknowledging that I don't know anything. <laughs> about camera lenses, um, you know, about uh, about that sort of thing. But I do know what it feels like as an actor uh, in a scene. And so I was like, I'm just gonna bring that into this environment. And everyone knows me already. And I'm uh, just coming in humble and just, you know, uh, acknowledging the greatness around me and just wanna make sure I capture it. Um, so it was awesome. It was just very easy, I would say, to be honest. Not easy <laughs> directing. <laughs> and acting at the same time, <laughs> but it was easy to step into that role and be willing to fail. That's great to hear. And Naomi, Danny mentioned that you also joined the writer's room this season too. So what was it like to take on that creative task? Yeah, it was so fun. You know, in a, uh, you know, I've written on shows in the past, but this is the first time coming into a show where I knew the characters already, not just, you know, knowing the people, but I knew who I was pitching for. I knew who they were and had a sense, you know? And so that made it so much more fun, being able to kind of hit the ground running as opposed to spending time feeling out, okay, who is everybody and what are they into? So that was so fun. And obviously it's also a great room because you do have a good handful of the actors in the writer's room too. So it gives it even more playfulness because we can kind of improvise and joke around in the room and then see that end up in a script, you know? 